So if I'm about to go to the store, I need you to watch Brian and Kyrie. Tamika, I am not watching your kids. They are not my responsibility. Damn. Not only do I have a toxic mother, but an abusive one too. One that can't aim. Savon, I've been told you you can leave my house whenever you're ready. And go where? Right! So the next time you decide to tell me what you're not going to do, think about where you would go if I kicked you out of my house. I already have plans. Well, they have been delayed. You will watch my children until I get back. Then you can proceed with your plans. Okay, Tamika. Ma, did I just hear you tell Savon he had to watch me and Kyrie? You did hear that, yes. Since when do I need a babysitter? Since your fast ass had a 23-year-old grown-ass man stop by my house looking for he you. He was 25. Your brother is watching you and I am done with this conversation. Can I at least have my phone back? For what? Savan has a phone and will contact me if there's an emergency. What are we, five? No, but you are an out of control teenager who needs 24 hours supervision. <sighs> Mama is having Savon babysit us. Mama, you can't even control me. What makes you think Savon can't control me? I will beat his ass. Oh, second thought, Mama, leave them with me. I want to see something. Savon, don't you be in here putting your hands on my child. And Kyrie... I will turn you every way but loose. Test it if you want to. He acts like that because you don't put your hands on him enough. Well, come on, ho. Come put your hands on me. Come teach me a lesson. I don't know about a lesson, but I will definitely teach. Never mind. It is clear that I can't leave y'all's asses alone. I just wanted to go to the grocery store so that I can cook dinner. But you know what? Y'all's asses can go ahead and help yourselves to whatever's in the fridge or the pantry. Or y'all can starve. Savon, what you want to do? Mama is still here. Oh my God. <laughs>